Welcome to Cadence Design Systems Pointwise Tutorial Tuesday where we show you how to use a feature or demonstrate a technique in just a couple of minutes. Today we're talking about the difference between max edge growth rate and boundary decay. Whenever I want to know more about a specific feature within Pointwise, I usually start at the user manual. In this case, max edge growth rate option in the advanced subframe limits the length of adjacent edges for a given cell. The default is 1.8, minimum is 1.0, and the maximum is infinity, and I don't think we should set it to infinity. But in any case, it is a great way to control how big adjacent cells are within an interior of a volume of an unstructured block. Conversely, boundary decay is how quickly cells grow as they move away from a boundary, whether it be an interior boundary such as a body or an exterior boundary like a far field. So let's see what that looks like in practice. I got three blocks here. I'm going to select them and we're going to create these settings. So grid solve, attributes, select the first one, change this to 1.2, select this third one, change the default to 0.9. This guy will be our control, and we'll click Initialize. Now that the blocks are done initializing, we can take a look at them. Our default block had a little less than 2 million. Max edge growth rate, about 2.1, and decay, about 2.5. Let's take a closer look and examine. I'm looking at edge length here, and you can see that in our default block, we have a nice extension into the volume gets a little bit further with the max edge growth rate of 1.2 and it gets even further with a decay of 0.9. Both of these settings can go the other way also. Hit cancel. With these three blocks I won't walk through making the adjustments on the settings but know that the max edge growth rate for this one is 4.0 and the decay for this one is 0.4. Keep in mind even though the decay is 0.4 here the growth rate is still 1.8. I'll click initialize. After initialization, you can see our control block is still about 1.2 million cells. The other two blocks are about 550,000 each, but do they look the same? Let's take a closer look. Again, I'm looking at edge length here, and you can see how different the interior of these blocks look. Remember, this is still set with a growth rate of 1.8. So even though the decay is 0.4, you can see out here in the middle of the block, the difference between a max edge growth rate of 4.0 and a max edge growth rate of 1.8. Additionally, recall that the decay for this one is 0.8 and how much tighter and further into the volume these cells go, as opposed to a decay to 0.4, which they don't go quite as far into the volume. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below or connect with us on LinkedIn or on Twitter. Thank you all. Have a pleasant Tuesday.